Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to um, enable your wireless tethering on your Android device and for this for this to work you don't need any hack, any root on your phone this should work for any device running Android and I wouldn't recommend this if you have a limited data plan because this will this will use a lot of data especially if you're um, on multiple devices um, so what this does is it it enables the the wireless tethering app, the mobile hotspot app that's in, installed on on your phone, which is blocked by carriers by uh, subscription. So th what this does is it overrides the subscription and lets you use the hotspot. So you're gonna download the file in the description. Go to your file explorer. Look for the app. It's called Control Version 1.1. So you're gonna click on it, install. I already have it installed. So let me show you how it works. You can go to the app, hotspot control, and this is the the free version. You can go on the the Play Store and download and download the donated version. I believe it's like ninety nine cents. So with this, to enable the Wi-Fi, I'm not Wi-Fi. To to use this, you're gonna set up first the name of your connection. Uh, mine's is Galaxy S three. You can change it to whatever you like, and my password is Android Wi-Fi. You can also change that as well. So, to start up the app, all you have to do is enable access point. And as you can see, it shows hotspot activated. And this is the version of mobile hotspot that comes with the Verizon Galaxy S3. So it's it's enabling the hotspot that's built in the phone already so it's not doing it from a uh, well you're enabling it from a separate app and you can control it from that app but you can also control it from the built-in one as well so if I click on Galaxy S3 allow all devices I can go to configure and I can also edit it from here as well but you can't turn it on from just going to settings and mobile hotspot you have to go through the app in order to enable it and again, you don't need to be rooted. You don't need uh, anything else installed in your phone. Just install the app and uh, just go through the settings and enable it. And again, if you have limited data on your plan, you might not want to use this because you might be, you might go, it's it's easy to go over your data when you're using something like your laptop or PS3 or Xbox, anything else using a mobile hotspot. And you're gonna get charged a lot so I wouldn't recommend this for for limited plans if you have unlimited like me I have unlimited 4G on Verizon so I use this for everything and it and it does come in handy and uh, that's that's pretty much it that's all you have to do and you can just shut it off from here or just go back into the app and then uh, just disable access point to turn it off And there you go, that's all you have to do.